All right, so this is a wobbly keyboard. I'm gonna try to fix it. Really hard to hook this. Um, should be. All right, give me one. All right, so we have this in there. So it's live flat. Okay, this is hard. There's no way I can do this. Is I'm all the way around. Put this in there.
I'm going this way, actually I'm going this way, where it pointed. Should have wanted Let's see sure I'll go with this. Should be should be pointing up like the folks this way. And then should hook up with this. Alright, it works now. I've oriented the wrong way. Now it's fine. It doesn't wobble. Well, it wobbled a little bit. Probably should have moved it, but... F it. I did it. Then you watch me struggle with it, so... Yeah, these are a pain in the butt. And then I'm gonna show you where to buy these. You can buy these. These are called, um, Crow Stars. This one's very pretty, because, like, it has a white on black. The white on black, and um, you see more colors. It's pretty cool. Looks like that. So yeah, you're gonna watch me struggle for a minute. So, um, why would you want this keyboard? It's tactile and clicky. Um, it has nice. RGB, it has a Synapse 3, so, and it's, um, razor green, it's nice and clicky. I like it because it, um, you see, there's a white bar under, so you see all the colors. It's pretty cool. Um, it's quick and responsive. Um, it comes with the hand rest but it doesn't last very long it's getting it gets messed up the hand rest like over the years so mine did it's built like a tank um so if you're missing the if you have a rally space bar then you can look for a chrome star bar no co-star star stabilizer stabilizer and it should work fine it's one of these it's like 10 bucks I have a link down below they're not that hard to install well they are really hard to install it, it took four to five minutes but I figured it out um, and then you get the black widow balancer Well, they don't have it. It's on eBay. It's called a balancer. I put the link down below too. But it's a CoStar balancer. CoStar. Stabilizer. There we go. It's one of these guys. So it's pretty nice. It's, it's like, um, it gives it a nice feel. You can lube the edges right, right here. Um. Um, so if you like lose a stabilizer, you can buy it here. You can't use any space bar because I like, all you gotta do is put the those little in the two spots. One of these, you can see it right here. Like one of these, I'll use like a sniping tool to show you. So we're gonna snipe. So it's uh, one of these guys. And just put it in the three holes. You can use like any space bar to 6.5 U. So you look for um, space bars. Space bars. Like you can do like one of these guys. And as long as I get a cherry version, then you can use any space bar. And then all I gotta do is put those these three things, two things on the. Use like any keycaps. Like um, keycaps. Doesn't matter. You can use like puddings. It's all good. As long as you use the um, co-star stuff, co-star stabilizer, one of these, and you're gonna go. You don't need to put the mounting because this is the 
the mounting right here and then all you need is that little guy right here to tool um, under and then you just put the press the bar you have to put it in the correct direction though you put the wrong direction it'll get sticky but um, if you don't put it it won't be sticky so that's how I fixed it I, I bought it like used it but now it's like good perfect um, highly recommend it so yeah so these are for like the space bars, the enters. Yeah, but installing them takes a, takes a lot of time. You have to hook them, you just remove the little guy right here from the um, enter key or space bar. And then it will be like a, the cherry plus, just put it in there. So go one, two, three, boom. But um, I like the cherry stabilizers. They're easier, but they have the screw-ins. And then I think these are the cherry stabilizers right here. Um, these are the ones you get like those um, GK61s They come with these these are not bad as long as the bar as long as all these are straight and yet you lube the tips it should be fine it's not a big deal um, as long as it functions so right here cheer your real stabilizers these are here that little feet this is funny. you can change these for these too but you're gonna need to like cut the hole in the middle right here so it comes out you see that um, you need a Dremel tool but that's the crazy mod I'm not gonna do it that's a really crazy mod so yeah um, so yeah these are like the clip on the board ones they're not the screw in ones so you can actually create your own keyboard it's not that hard it's, everything's like, compatible it's like plug and play. As long as you can solder and use a Dremel tool and mod your stuff, you're good to go. So they recommend the Razer Greens. They're pretty nice. The Chroma V2s are really, really nice. Um, it's really sturdy. I think it, as long as you vacuum the keyboard once in a while and not get dust in the switches, it'll last a very long time. Because this thing's like five years old and it still types. So yeah. Um, if you get the links down below for like the stabilizers, if you have a wobbly spacebar, you can just replace it. As long as your cherry um, switch is fine, you just got you can replace it with any spacebar if it breaks or any keycap. It takes everything. It's fine. It's actually around the correct size. So that's about it. That's crazy. So there's only two main stabilizers, like these cherry ones and the crow star. Star stabilizer. These two and those are the main ones. Um, since since the um these use the co-star ones, they're um not that wobbly. Pretty strong. Cause watch. I feel good. I prefer these over the other ones. Those these are better. So yeah, peace.